Do four more turns. Breathe now, breathe. I'll try. Hello, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog and welcome to our bathroom. This is the Dad Delivers vlog. Wow, it's really echoey in here. This is the Dad Delivers vlog where we try to be happy with what we've already got. So I'm sharing my experiences as a dad and today I'm going to be stumbling through this. It's the, oh, that's a bigger one. It's the Ikea Kulana toilet seat and today I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to attempt the impossible. I'm going to try and replace a square toilet seat with a round toilet seat. I'm going to bend physics. I'm going <laughs> to do the impossible. I do not know why we bought a square toilet. Well, I say we, it was me. I, I chose this. I know why. It's because it was cost effective. It was cheap. And then I realised it's cheap for a reason. Nobody wants a square toilet. It is ridiculous. <laughs> Toilets have been round since Victorian times, since the Industrial Revolution. I thought we would get more toilet for our bucks, but this soft close is, 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 well, it's a bit no close, isn't it? As you know, this is the second worst job that a dad can do in a house. The first worst job, obviously, is trying to find parking while your child has gone to accident and emergency in hospital. You know, fumbling around for change. That's the worst job. The second worst job is this, changing a toilet seat. I know there are worse jobs in the home, but look at this. This has gone really not very well. There's a, there's a crack here. This is why men don't put the seat down because you know, you know the wear and tear is eventually gonna lead to the day where you've got to change the thing. You just don't want to do anything to shorten that finite life and, and end up like me on my hands and knees in the bathroom fitting a new toilet seat. And so we have salvation in the form, the round form of the Ikea Kalana round toilet seat. Seat. This is an unboxing. I'm going to open it like a pizza, I think. Let's see what's inside. Ah, oh, it is. It's like a delicious pizza that you can sit on and it will comfort you. We've got some crucial instructions, some protective cloth. Ah, oh, and the toilet seat itself. There's the crucial bag of bits. Now, I don't, I don't know if this is even going to fit our toilets. So there's a bit of jeopardy in this video because this, this video could end very quickly. Now I'm running the camera in real time. Whoa. Now I'm running the camera in real time. Ugh. Let's take this away. I think that's an IKEA product too. Ding. So the first step is to remove this monstrosity from our Frankenstein toilet. Oh, gotta reach up. Oh, there's only one way this rust has happened. Oh. And the problem with toilet seat rust is that it stops the nut from turning on the thread. Oh, I'm having to force it through the toilet seat rust. Oh man, oh, this is hard. Now the other problem I've got with this situation is that I might have to keep all of the bits because I might have to put this seat back on. Okay, this should work. It won't move. Work. Oh, got it. There we go. That's removed, but I've got to be super careful. And then hopefully these will come off. Uh, <laughs> None of my Allen keys fit, and I've not given the gift to myself of keeping the actual Allen key for this actual seat. I, I think I did keep it, and then I threw it away. I can feel the last rust coming off the bottom. Just four more turns. Breathe now, breathe. I'll try. Oh, I've got it. Oh. Whoa! You birthed it. <laughs> I've got to do the other one now. That's taken 30 minutes. For the other side, I'm going to use a hacksaw to try and get through here to get to the screw. Okay, that didn't work, so I'm now just <laughs> forcing it out by just bending it as hard as I can without trying to crack the toilet. Although well, cracking the toilet would be a bit of a relief right now, but... Hey, got it! I did it! It's gone! Uh, <coughs> Next, I'll clean it with, with this. Next goes on the Kulana toilet seat from Ikea. So this makes it my Ikea dad vlog. This is my one of my Ikea dad videos. I've got a whole channel over, over here. 
we get a bag of bits and the first job is to fit these things to the bottom of the seats on the hinges just like this you press them down on the silver or chrome hinges there next you need to choose your hole and you do that by measuring the gap between the two holes in your toilet bowl your toilet basin there mine is 148 millimeters which matches these sections in the instructions so that's how I know where to put the bolt and then these plastic nuts go onto the bolts now it's time for the reach around the filthy toilet reach around uh, I put these nuts onto the bolts it's a bit difficult to uh, reach around and hold the bolt on ah drop the nuts final part we're nearly there we just need this thing to tighten up the bolts so I'll just twist this around and that will lock the nuts on the bolts underneath the toilet bowl and I think this is it I think I've managed to sort of do it it's not quite what I wanted but this is the Kalana Ikea toilet seat and uh, it sort of works with the square bowl is coming out but it has a soft closed lid for both both the seat and the lid and this isn't quite what I wanted but it is at least it comes out as far as the front edge there obviously it's square so it doesn't fit the seat at all but I've got a toilet seat that isn't cracked and that might actually work and not crash down in the middle of you know what and it's good it feels solid and oh my goodness check out the chrome fittings there on the on the hinges we will never see them this color again <laughs> that is going to turn into rust over time i'm sure but i'm just going to enjoy it while it lasts so that's it i hope this helps it's a very specific problem <laughs> trying to find a round seat on a square toilet bowl if this if this video has helped and you've reached this point i'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers i don't think i'm ever going to do it but if you were to click on my face and hit subscribe that would be huge help for me and here right here in the corner is what YouTube thinks you want to be watching next can you please help my daddy get 1,000 subscribers just click on his face thanks bye how was that